So after you cook a delicious meal here in America, what do you have to do? You have to clean those dishes. The beautiful thing is in America, we have dishwashers. For many foreigners and international students, a dishwasher is a new appliance you've never used before. But the beautiful thing is they actually get things cleaner, they save time, and even save you money. So we're gonna teach you guys how to use the dishwasher, and trust me, I think you guys are gonna love it. Hey friends, welcome to Chine Coaching, I'm Rob. We love help guiding international people to success in their cross-cultural journey. And I've been helping move in a lot of new students this year. They've been getting a lot of questions about appliances. In this video, we're gonna talk about dishwashers, specifically today. Other videos, we're gonna talk about washing machines and other appliances, so be sure to check those out as well. But a dishwasher can save you a lot of time, a lot of energy, and clean all of your dishes. We've got my buddy Umang here. He's graciously hosting us. We just had some delicious chai. Umang, go ahead and introduce yourself. Hi guys, I'm Umang. I'm from West Bengal, India. Here to pursue my master's in business analytics. And so we have dirtied a few glasses right now and Rob's here to help me figure out the appliances. So I'm so glad. <laughs> <laughs> so a dishwasher is a machine that the name explains itself. It washes your dishes for you. It's a beautiful thing. Pretty much once you're done eating, you can just stick the stuff in there, put a little bit of special soap, which we'll show you, press the start button and it goes. So one thing that's important to note is that there's actually a different special type of soap. The hand soap that you use for hand washing dishes is different. So dishwasher soap, you can get the liquid form or even in little packets and pods that you just drop into the spot, which we'll show you guys. And then that's what's gonna clean up the dishes. One bonus about the dishwasher is once you're done eating, if you wash it quickly, you can just stick them in, run it, even with food and dirty stuff on it. Now like our family, we only wash our dishes maybe once a day after a few meals, because that's when it gets all full up. So what I usually do is I do a pre-rinse. I'll rinse all the big food items, the big particles off, stick it in, and then that day or the next day we'll run it. Mm -hmm. But these new dishwashers, if you have a recently modern dishwasher, it'll clean it really well. Two things to know that's really important with the dishwasher is one, it's gonna get the dishes actually cleaner. Because it uses really high temperatures in there, it's gonna kill the germs better than what you can do hand washing it in the sink. So I know you think, oh, I'm gonna hand wash it, it's more efficient, but it's actually more clean because of the high temperature for the cleaning and the drying of the dishwasher, especially with the pandemic, with sicknesses, it's just gonna be safer to clean your utensils and plates in the dishwasher. And two, Research has been done that shows actually use less water in a dishwasher compared to using a sink. So if you want to save money on your water bill, again, you might be thinking, oh, it's going to save water. This dishwasher is going to use so much, but actually no, the dishwasher is more water efficient, especially modern ones. And so it'll save money on your water bill as well. So some dishwashers, you literally just pull it open. This one has a handle. So you click the button, pull it open. And most of them are going to have two racks bottom rack and a top rack. These are the sprinklers, the sprayers, where the water is gonna come out. You got one on the bottom and also one on the top. So it's gonna spray from beneath for all the things in here. The bottom rack is for the bigger items. That's where we'll put plates, um, maybe a big bowl, a big dish, uh, a big coffee mug, and then this side tray is for utensils, spoons, forks, straws, any kind of small things, measuring spoons. Um, glass, metal things are more for the bottom, and then plastic things are better for the top. Um, so cups you'll put in the top, bowls, you know, other utensils you'll set up here in the top. So big items in the bottom, smaller items and plastics go more on the top. One important thing is that most big pots and pans should not go in the dishwasher. Things like this that you're gonna cook on the stove top, um, especially if you bring something from your home country, it's probably not gonna be dishwasher safe. So better to hand wash these things in the sink with this kind of soap because you don't want the dishwasher because of the high temperatures to accidentally ruin. Just about everything you buy at the store, at Walmart, Target, Dollar Tree, Ikea, is dishwasher safe. But in America, you can always look at the bottom and here it says dishwasher and microwave safe. So that's gonna indicate, yeah, I can put it in here 
and it's not gonna get hurt. So once it's all full, ready to go, you've got it majority full or totally full. You can even run it half full if you want to, just so you have clean stuff. The next thing you're gonna do is put the soap, the detergent. So there's a little compartment here. There's usually a button or a latch. And for the liquid, you just squeeze a little bit. Again, the instructions on how much, kind of a thumb size or cap full. And there's even a second spot for special stuff like pre-wash or extra shiny. So there's special additive things you can add if you want extra or special clean. But just usually the soap is good enough. Or if you have the pods, you drop the pod in here, close it up, and you're ready to go. So newer dishwashers have a lot of different options. There's different cycles like a heavy cycle, a normal cycle, a one hour quick rinse. And so heavy is like big meals, lots of food, everything's still fresh on the plate. You throw it in, it's gonna clean everything off. We usually just do normal. We kind of pre-rinsed our stuff. Normal might run an hour and a half long and it's gonna get everything clean. If you just got a few small items or wanna do a quick wash, you can do the one hour here. Then there's the drying options as well. What's nice is it actually can dry the dishes for you too. So you can do a heat dry, high temperature, you can do a delay. And so if you wanna have it wash later, you know, or during the night, you know, you can pick the time. And then again, just the start and cancel button, hit start, and it's ready to go. So our chai question for this video is, have you ever used a dishwasher before? Let us know in the comments, tell us what you think. Did you like it? Did you not like it? Tell us in the comments, have you ever used a dishwasher before? So one interesting thing is, most international students here do not use the dishwasher. They just use it as a cupboard. Usually it's a storage place for their pots and pans or places or clean dishes. We'll hand wash them and then put the clean dishes in here rather than actually using it to clean. So I hope you guys will try it out, at least experiment and see if it's worth the time, see if you save money. And we're actually gonna have links to soap and pods that you guys can buy online, um, get it delivered straight to your door. Try it out, see if it works, see if you guys like it. I think you might. Also, we're gonna make some other videos on things like how to use a washer and drying machine and other just kind of basic appliances around your home. Make sure you're using them the right way. That way you're also utilizing all the features to again, to save time, money, and not break something in your home. So mom, what do you think about the dishwasher? Oh, so I'm stoked about this. I like, it's so magical to me. Like you eat everything and then let the dishwasher do the efforts for you. Have you ever seen this in India yet? Uh, so I've seen at a couple of places, like fancy places, but yeah. Yeah. So it was only in my last year or two in India where these actually were kind of for sale at the markets where you could buy them at appliance shops. So they were just kind of coming up in India, still kind of a fancy premium thing. Uh, exactly. Most people obviously did by hand or you'd have, you know, maybe a maid to help. We definitely missed that. <laughs> but here in America, when you have to do it all yourself, it's really helpful to use the dishwasher to save time, save money, and hope you guys will check it out again. We want to see you guys succeed in America. Be sure to connect with us online, on social media. We want you guys to be part of the Chai and Coaching community to help serve you guys. And if you have any other ideas or questions, let us know in the comments. My friends, if this video was helpful, give a big like and thumbs up to say thanks to Umal for uh -huh. allowing us to test drive his dishwasher to show you how the basics work. And yeah, hopefully this will be really helpful for you guys. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you guys next time at Chai and Coaching. Yep. Cheers. Cheers.